Okay, so this is graph this line described by y minus three equals negative one sixth x plus three. Um, you can either graph it the way it is using point slope form because it's written in point slope form, or you can translate or um, manipulate the equation to get it into slope intercept form. But we're going to just leave it the way it is because it's in point slope. And if you remember, point slope formula is equal to y minus y1 equals m times x minus x1, where the point on the line is x1, whoops, x1, y1, and my slope is m. So in this case, I can look at the equation I have and deduce that the slope, or the sorry, the point on my equation is whatever this x term is, it's the opposite. So if it's going through positive 3, the x coordinate I'm looking at is negative 3. And whatever the y value is, it's opposite. So the y value is going to be positive 3. So my line is going to go through the line, the point negative 3, comma 3. So negative 3, comma, it's going to go right through here. And I have the slope being 1 over 6. So from this point, I can go down one, down one unit, over six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now it's just a matter of connecting those two points. Obviously, using the um, line drawing tool on my upper map. Now, if you don't like to do it that way, that's fine. I, you can get it to also look like a slope intercept form. So I'm gonna get this to look like y equals mx plus b. By doing that, I'm just gonna first distribute the negative one six to both terms. So I have y minus three equals negative one sixth x. And then negative one six times three is gonna give me negative one half. That'll be three over six. That reduces to one half. Then it's a matter of just, <coughs> excuse me, adding three to both sides. So we get y equals negative one sixth x, negative one half plus three is going to be positive five halves or 2.5. So now that this is in slope intercept form, you can graph it using the fact that this is the y intercept. Zero comma five halves puts me right here. Use my slope, you'll get another point. Uh, it will be off, off the chart, it'll be down here. Or sorry, it'll be right here. So it looks like the way it's written would be better because you actually have a point on the line that you can graph.